from Factorio. Last episode, we did some con we made construction robots. Yes, construction robots. And between episodes, I made quite a bit more. When I say quite a bit, I mean about 50 of them more. I think a few more, but uh, maybe exactly 50. I don't know. Wow, exactly 50. That's having a really strange coincidence. Okay, well, anyways. Uh, you may notice something here. Yeah, I hope I'm hoping I, I, I remember to put the uh, cutscene in here. But yeah, I moved this entire thing, and yeah, it was pretty cool, I say. So yeah, I'm hoping you guys will enjoy that little part of there, and it won't be too long. But anyways, let's go on with today's episode. And today we're gonna focus on the other type of robots that we unlocked, which are logistic robots. And between episodes, I also researched the uh, logistic system. So now we have two new chests, the quester and provider chest. And so to do that, I'm gonna get some slug chests here, which I got myself. And wait a sec, I'm, I just lost an item in these inventories. Wait one sec, uh, blah, blah, blah. Where is it, where is it? Uh, did I make it? Oh, whatever, okay. Anyways, I'm gonna need to get myself some of these. These are gonna be some requester chests. I'm gonna make all of them I can. All you are is a smelt chest, which I made a bunch of between, and then uh, an advanced circuit each, which are kind of expensive, but eh, it's worth it. So anyways, now let's go down here, and let's get a few more of these guys. Oh, 50 of these, that's going to be great, and 50 of these. And let's make 50 of these. I think if you shift left click, yeah, shift left click will make all of them you can. And now, I just need to find a spot to put them, this thing. So I need going need to put down my robot ports. And as I told you before, these things are connect bec between where these oranges, that's where the uh, regular one is, I mean the logistic ones are. Where the uh, green is, that is where the uh, construction robots are. And as you can see, they can link together. So I'm going to need to get this corner in, let's see, can I get everything I need to get in there? Ooh, so close, so close. Okay, yeah, right there, that's where I need it to be, right around there, that's perfect. Okay, I just need to get there, where am I? Okay, I like, where did my guy go? Okay, so right here. Perfect. That's good, perfect for now, anyway. So yeah, this gets in everything. So I'm gonna need, I see a few more chests, but I'll get, worry about that later. And uh, I'm probably gonna need to get some other guys too, so I'm just gonna put these guys in here for now. And also I'm gonna put this, this in here. So if I do this by accident, let's say, I don't know, I got my gun by accident, I start shooting a chest, or I start shooting a light. My uh, construction will, will actually get one of these um, repair packs and repair it for me, which is pretty cool, I say. Anyway, so let's see, let's continue on. Uh, We're going to need to get, and I'm going to put them in certain locations around the map. So one here, one here, one here, yeah, one there, one here. One here, one here, one here, one here, one here, one here, here. Oh man, I'm gonna have to move everything up a few blocks because I need to get these guys in. I can move this one over a few. No, I can't move it enough. Okay, I'm gonna need to move it up. Just a few, I guess. That might be a problem, but I can probably walk around it. I, I'll find a walk around for it. Cause I need to be pretty low. Wait, I can get to here. Yeah, that's not gonna be enough. Okay, let's just leave it where it was. Which was right here. Okay, and uh, yeah, I'll find a walk around for that. Uh, let's see. I'll bring this upwards instead. I'll do that. How about that? Do. I'm also gonna need to rejoin the power right there. And this was here. Iron, right? Because, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So I'm gonna get one of these. Wait. Oh, no, just. I'm pretty sure I just took down two things, but. Oh, well, whatever. Let's just continue going as if nothing happened. I'll look back and see what I messed up. I'll probably figure it out in a few seconds, but, uh, anyway, let's do that. That. Get myself my requester chest right there. Boosh. And connect this all to power. Let's put it on the opposite side to make it look nicer. There we go. And that should be within the range. Yeah, there we go. That's right. And uh, let's see. Where else do I need these requests? I have four more for a reason. So one here, one here, one here. And one more somewhere. 
Maybe I need 15. I actually accidentally used this one. Let's look around quickly. Yeah, that's got it. That's right. Oop, that game is closed for a second. Um, then I'll figure it out eventually. But anyways, now we can set this stuff up. So I'm gonna say this guy. I want this guy to keep in copper plates at about keep 200 in here at all times. Now shift left click and shift right click here to save the settings there. Save the settings. I think this guy that's an iron one, isn't it? That's for iron. That's for iron. This one's for copper. So 100 here. I'm also gonna change this guy to copper. Okay, boss. And let's see, what else do we need copper in? Copper, 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 copper. Right here we need copper. Right here we need copper. And I think that is everywhere we need copper. So now we're gonna get the iron one going. So iron right here, we're gonna say, we're gonna want to get iron at 200 once again. So left, oh, nope, wrong one. Oop, auto save the map. Thank you, so I'm gonna change that to iron. Yeah, there we go. Oh, no, I want to get it to 200. And shift left click. There we go. And shift right click on the one we want. So iron here, iron here. Uh, that's 100. What? That's it. 200. 200. Oh, okay. There. Oops, I messed that up. There we go. Okay. Shift left click, shift right click, shift right click. Uh, that's not iron. Uh, iron needs to be right here. That's in within range, right? Uh, yeah, that is within range. Iron here and iron here. And let's see, anywhere else I need to have iron. Uh, I think that might be everywhere. Perfect though. And finally, I need to get these guys set up. So this one. Oh, that's that's why. This is not. That's not supposed to be a request chest too. That's supposed to be a provider chest. Uh, I'll get that. Okay, I'm going to get myself three provider chests, a few provider chests actually now I think about it, so uh, what do we need to get provider chests? We need more iron, so uh, there we go, oh no we need steel, uh, do we have any steel in here? There we go, there's my steel, thought I had steel, and okay, so let's make ourselves five of these and that should be good. These are, you know, wrong one, wrong one, wrong one, it's these ones I want, nope. These ones I want, but yeah, the red ones. Oh, that's where it is. Okay, it's over here. I had one. Okay, I knew I had one of them. Here they are. Okay, so this is gonna be a provider chest, and this is gonna be a provider chest, and this is gonna be a provider chest. And where else do we need provider chests? We need one right here for the circuit. One right here for batteries. One way, nope, none, no more here. I might put, I'm going to probably get a bunch more of these in between episodes. Get a bunch more stuff automated. Oh, I'm going to need to make another robo part in a bit, but I guess I can just put it down for now. Or I can find a walk around. Ah, oh, whatever, I'll just get another one. Then that should be filling up with steel in a bit. So yeah, everything looks pretty good. Now let's see how the system works. Oh! I already had the logistical robots in, I forgot, oh yes, things are happening, things are happening guys, look at that, robots are going to fly over there, pick up some iron and copper, and it's going to bring them over to where they need to be, see, copper goes in there, and yeah, everything's good, so this is probably going to get a big bunch of copper in there just then, well I just used it all, but you get the picture, so yeah, we're going to need a lot of more of these logistic robots, so let's see, how many more flying robots do we get, 36, that's a good start, I'm going to need to get myself some more of these guys, 200. What are we missing here? We're missing circuits. We're missing a copper here. So let's get ourselves another quest or chest here. And a place to say that we need some copper here. Copper, 200. 200 at all times. And I should keep 200 copper in there at all times. But for now, let's just put a few, uh, a stack, uh, two stacks in there. Just to get things started up. And because we need those uh, things going, get going. And I might limit this. I uh, probably gotta limit this to about let's go with 400. Oh, not 400. That's that's actually uh, 800. Let's go with a uh, 1,000 actually then. There we go. That's good, good, good. This guy's already limited. Let's see. What are we missing here? We're missing iron once again. So uh, we'll probably get a bunch more of these things saying, okay, we need this. Okay, we need this. Okay, no, 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 we need this. 
But for now, I think we should be doing, we're doing pretty well. So let's see, we got a few more of these. Let's make a bunch more of these. Shift left click to get all of them we need, we have. And also, we don't need to place these inside the robot. We can actually just do this. <laughs> Which I find really fun to do. Let's just get a bunch of them and let's get a bunch of these going. Ready? So I'm just going to wait for all of these to finish crafting. Just a few more seconds. There we go, and go! Yeah, that looks awesome. Look at that, iron and copper going everywhere. And things are rolling, people. Things are getting going. So it's gonna take a bit of time before it starts like, actually getting everything done. Let's see, why is this guy going? Oh, that's what it was here. Okay, figured out what was here now. Iron gear wheels. So, uh... First, let me see, where is the, uh... Logistic system going. Okay, so we let's bring this here and right there. Perfect. Okay, that's gonna be a perfect spot for that. Wish I'd done it that sooner, actually. Now that I think about it. Okay, so let's put this uh, this guy right here because that's gonna power a light. Okay, too. So we can do this and this, or we can get rid of the light and then move the light over here so we can power everything at one time. That's gonna work a lot better. And this is gonna be the gear wheels again. Uh, Where are the gear wheels? I always missed, missed them. There we go, there we go. And everything should be working again. So things are still start moving through the uh, the products or the whatever. And these things should be able to keep up with all the, uh, the demands of our stuff we need. Let's see. Yeah, things are hardly moving. We, we're going to need a lot more of these logistical. Let's click out so you can just see everything though. Ooh, look at that. There's like a bunch of a lineup for people wanting to use this. Uh, let's see, how much power is this using? 1.1 megawatts. That's quite a bit, actually. Uh, let's see, anything we need to... Okay, we're, go we're pretty good on all of these gases, that's good. But I just want to make sure we weren't running low. This guy's gonna require iron a bit, but uh... Yeah, it's okay. Oh, let's have these uh, ones up here, I forget. Uh, let's see. Uh, no, I did not set up these, did I? No. So this is gonna be a provider, but this is gonna be a requesting steel. Oh, I forgot you don't take it from there. You could. This is gonna request a hundred. Let's go two hundred steel. This is gonna request two hundred batteries. Uh, batteries. Two hundred of those, perfect. And this is gonna request circuit. Two hundred of these. And that should be working. Everything should now be working fine. Let's see, what's stopping this guy now? Uh, copper over here needs... No. Iron, that's what we're waiting on. We're waiting on iron over here. Okay. So, uh, we can actually upgrade these guys too to carry more. But, um, if we look at the research, uh, the research for carrying more requires 200 of these science pack 3s. And then we can also get them to go faster for only 50. I think that's the next one I'm going to do. Faster ones. Because if they can move faster, they can transport stuff faster. So, uh, and there's only 50 of them, so, uh, yeah, it's not bad. It's not bad cost. Let's see, how are things doing over here? Let's see, how many more flying robots? We got seven. Yeah, see how slow these are. It's not that, it's not particularly fast, but it gets the job done. I can, I'm probably gonna upgrade them. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna probably upgrade them in between episodes. And now I'm just gonna wait for this la this last thing to finish researching. I'm just trying to bla I'm just blabbling along right now, waiting for this thing to finish researching. Oops, this is done. So yeah, that's the, for the final part of the uh, thing we need. So I'm gonna put this guy right here. Let's put this brother right here, why not? Looks like a good spot. And put down a rail, not a rail, uh, put down a conveyor belt. I've been playing way too much Minecraft, as you guys can probably tell. Well, I've been playing a lot, but I haven't been recording, as I said before, because recording makes my Java extremely messed up, because my, for some reason my Java is being messed up too. So yeah, I'm just going along with whatever's happening. Let's see, everything's working fine. Yeah, everything looks like to be going good. And these are working well, working good, 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 good. Let's see, do I have any blue science packs left over? I'm pretty sure I have a few. Uh, no. No. Oh, and here's the blueprint for the thing. Just take a look at that. That's my entire research facility. All there, minus the robo port there. That's my entire research facility, and I used robots to move it over here. That is pretty mind-boggling, if you ask me. It's extremely cool, I say. 
I really wish I could do like more massive stuff like that, but uh, sadly not right now. Let's see how these electronics work. It's probably going to need to upgrade this, this system even more. I know, I think I have an idea how I'm going to do it, but uh, we'll get into that later. But I'm just, right now I'm just like making stuff when I need it. And um, I'm probably going to move these guys around too. I'm just moving a bunch of stuff around for right now. This guy's probably going to move. I am going to keep that there probably, but they have. Oh, this one's running low on iron. Um, yeah, I'm probably going to move that just to use the main iron from here. And keep a certain amount of iron in stock for us. Batteries are not getting produced because I forgot we did not set up the request for the batteries, did I? Oh no, that's a passive provider. Pick up seven. Yeah, so in total we have 78 in the system. Oh, oh I guess there's eight, seven moving around, I guess that means. Oh yeah, there's some, some right there. Yeah, uh, come on, hurry up. Oh wait, what are we waiting on for this? Uh, green science fact. Oh, and we're waiting on iron for that. Okay, you know what, I'm just gonna get, get the help this system get going. There we go. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three. Oh, auto saving map. Okay, I'm just gonna help the system get going. We're starting this off with a bunch of iron. There we go, that should be good. Good, good. You can just like slowly see like one of them getting made each time. Kind of frustrating sometimes because eventually it's gonna be a lot better, but. I, I made this base specifically around the fact that these robots are awesome in the future. They're going to be a lifesaver. There. You can go, there are a few different types of bases you can go. You can go logistic system style. You can go main belt style. This is the way I want to try out for this season. But yeah, I guess you can call it season. Yeah, this this way, way, this way. I want to try it out this way for once. Cause that's when I've been playing in single player by myself in another world. I did the um, another way of doing it, the main belt system I thought I was saying, but I wanted to try this out. It looks fun, because uh, at the beginning it's like told you to set everything up, go, okay I want this, I need this, I need this now, I need this now, but uh, in the future it's like get a lot better. Okay there we go, that is now done, and let's see what I'm going to research while I'm waiting for stuff to go, probably the, uh, let's go with the speed, and now if I look at my inventory, we have this cool thing right here. And let's say, I'm gonna say, I want to keep in my inventory 200 copper. So if you look in a second, give, give it a sec, you'll really be like, hey, this guy wants copper. And, come on, hey dude, you gonna give me the copper? Well, it's supposed to give me copper, so I'm gonna do the same thing with iron. Say so I'm gonna want 200 iron each time, all the time. Yes, yeah, it just gave me a bit of copper, see? And let's see, what else should, should can I say I want? Um, Raw fish. They have fish in this? Shooting speed? Wait, what? Come again, what? Fish. Um, what? Okay, that's really weird. Anyway, let's see. I can also say, okay, I want to keep 100 ammo on me. So I'm going to say, okay, I always want ammo, but I'm not going to do that because I do not have any system for game automatically giving me ammo. Oh, there's real guns? I didn't... Oh, yeah. Wait, what? There's real guns? No, no, no. Oh, well, whatever. Uh, let's see, what else can we say we want to have on us at all times? Um, probably go up and make insert or something soon. So, uh, let's say we want, uh, we want, I want, uh, ten of these in our inventory. And ten of these in our inventory. Uh, yeah, that's cool. And let's say we want some steel in our inventories at all times. A hundred steel. So yeah, everything should now just give me items whenever I need it, but at the moment it's going to be very slow, as I said before. Probably want to keep everything else up first, so uh, yeah, I'm just sure probably going to let things, these things go first. But uh, anyways, well, that's all the time we have for this episode. Yeah, this will be a bit of a drag on episode, just talking about these logistic robots standing around. But I think it's pretty cool, these robots. I mean, just look at this guy. This is fl the robots flying around my base, giving me items. I'm going next time, next time you're going to be cooking my dinner. <laughs> if I can figure out how fishing works, yeah, that, that looks pretty cool. But yeah, that's all the time we have for this episode. So yeah, I would like to thank you all for watching. Please like, subscribe, comment, thank you, and goodbye.